as always, got to bring you some Prince Harry news this morning. And this one is just an absolute gold. It really is. So, I don't know if you know, but there's a think tank in the States called the Heritage Foundation. And they are essentially taking the Biden administration to court, right, the Department of Homeland Security, because they want to know whether Prince Harry, on his visa, declared that he had basically had more drugs that have gone through him than you'd find in Colombia, right? Now, in his memoir, Spare, he spoke about having taken cocaine, he spoke about having taken marijuana, he spoke about having taken magic mushrooms, all of these different drugs he spoke about having taken. And then, of course, he has gone to live in the States. Now, he doesn't have American citizenship, but he has gone to live in the States. So the think tank, the Heritage Foundation, wanted to... Was it called the Heritage Foundation? Um, I can't remember what it's called. Heritage. Yes, it is Heritage. They wanted to know whether Prince Harry had been truthful on his forms when he was applying for his immigration, or whether he was not truthful, in which case he's lied, or if he was truthful, whether he was given favourable treatment. Well, this is absolutely brilliant, because now the lawyers who were arguing the Joe Biden side, the lawyers for the administration said, from Department of Homeland Security, said, oh, hang on, and I quote, he said, you can't take what was written in spare as the truth. In fact, he actually said that he could have exaggerated stories about taking drugs, the prince, in order to sell copies of his book, Spare. He said, just saying something in a book doesn't make it true. The lawyer added that people say things to sell books, as he argued Harry's immigration records should remain private. So you know of this absolutely staggering situation in the States, right? Where the lawyers who are arguing Prince Harry's case to keep his immigration file secret are saying, oh, no, no, you can't believe a word he says in that book. Yet we are supposed to believe he was attacked by Prince Harry. We're supposed to believe that his family had a grudge against him. We're supposed to believe that that uh, Princess Catherine was absolutely terrible towards Meghan. We're supposed to believe that Meghan was the victim of terrible racism. And now the lawyers on Prince Harry's side are saying, oh, no, 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 you can't believe a word he wrote in that book. Oh, no, 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 we've got to... You, you, you can't ask us to, to show his immigration files because he hasn't told the book, truth in that book. He, he, he's, he's a complete exaggerator and a liar in the book Spare. So imagine this. Imagine we've got the scenario now where either Prince Harry has lied through his teeth in the book Spare, in which case he hasn't taken any drugs, he didn't take all those magic mushrooms, Courtney Cox's pedal bin didn't have a conversation with him, because that was one of the stories that he told in the book Spare, that Courtney Cox's pedal bin had a conversation with him and he also at one point had a conversation with the moon and the worrying thing about that was that the moon actually answered which is quite staggering so you either got that he's either someone who lied about that or he didn't lie and he's a drug addict and he says that he's not brought the crown and the monarchy into disrepute He's actually arguing, or the people on his side of this, Homeland Security, it isn't actually Harry's lawyers, it's the, it's the lawyers for Homeland Security are saying, no, 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 we're going to keep his files sealed because even though he admitted to taking all these drugs, you cannot believe a word he says. Or he is telling the truth, in which case then he has taken every drug under the sun. Either way, it doesn't look very good for him, does it? And it's yet another little gem as to how he brings the monarchy into massive disrepute.